Financial Times, uh, you criticised what was apparent, what you apparently termed as sinophobia uh, in the United States and perhaps the broader West in its dealings with the region. Can you expand on that? So what did you mean by that? How does that manifest? And can I also ask, do you view Australia's attempts to build up its own military capacity, including through AUKUS, in the face of Beijing's own massive military build-up, do you view that as a reasonable response, or does Malaysia harbour concerns? In our Asian tradition, difficult questions should be addressed to the host. Ah. <laughs> but anyway, my reference to China phobia is because the criticism levied against us for giving additional focus to China. My response is trade investments uh, is open. And uh, right now, uh, China seems to be the leading investor in trade into Malaysia. Cumulatively, it's still the United States of America. Uh, it's open um, trading uh, policy to encourage uh, investments overseas uh, from foreign countries. Now, but we are an independent nation. Uh, we are fiercely independent. We do not want to be dictated by any force. So whilst we remain to be an important uh, friend um, to the United States or Europe and here in Australia, they should not um, preclude us from being friendly to one of our important neighbours, precisely China. Well, that was the context. And if they have problems with China, they should not impose it upon us. We do not have a problem with China. So yeah. that's why I, I, I referred to the issue of China phobia in the West.